So what is the difference between whey and whey plus casein blends when looking at protein? So when we consume protein, what we really want to do is stimulate muscle protein synthesis. And this is the process through which we take uh, protein, we take amino acids, and we build muscle out of it. Now, this process actually has two, two parts to it. It has the initiation and the elongation. Initiation is just turning it, uh, is just turning it on. It's, it's like if you're in a car, just stepping on the pedal and getting to accelerate. The elongation is you actually continuously pressing on the pedal and getting somewhere. So to initiate muscle protein synthesis, you need between two to three grams of an amino acid called leucine. And this is most likely going to be found in about 20 to 30 grams of a high quality protein. Now, when you look at a protein that is very easily digested and is very fast digested, like just pure whey or whey isolate, yes, it can initiate muscle protein synthesis, but it gets digested so fast that it doesn't support the elongation of muscle protein synthesis. When you look at whey plus casein, <clears throat> just casein, then they can, they can uh, stimulate it, initiate it, and then support the elongation of it. Excellent. So, uh, yeah. No, that's good. That's good. Did you have anything else to add? N no, it was probably just going to be way too sciencey. <laughs> okay. No, I appreciate that. Awesome.